Robin Manetti. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to bout number seven of the evening. Total respect live from the Matthew Feathers Hotel. This fight brought to you by Chef Pierre Kocha. Three by two in rounds. Kickboxing rules in the featherweight division. Your referee in charge. Mark Cook. Firstly, fighting out of the blue corner, trained out of the Invictus gym, wearing black trunks, with the Croatian flag on the right hand side, official weight 60.5 kilograms, representing Tullo Marine, Marco the Psycho Olympics. And across the ring, his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, training out of the Goodson gym, out of the Bronx. Wearing red trunks with black and gold, official weight 61 kilograms. Representing Reservoir, Rapid Fire, Robert Manetti! Both fighters centering. Okay, you both had the rules explained here. Just listen for my call when I say break, break. Yep, touch gloves and come out fighting. Well, here we go, Johnny. This is the bout I've been waiting a long time for. The return to the ring of Robert Rapid Fire Maniti. At 40 years of age, making his comeback here at Total Respect at the Matthew Flinders Hotel. In his corner, Nick Thunderkick Talakouris, Flash Tui. Aaron the one Goodson, and he, what a task for him, taking on the psycho, Marco Olovic, here in his comeback fight. Yeah, Marco Olovic trained by Theo Galetis out of the Invictus gym. This is three minute rounds, and a big thank you to Chef Pierre for getting behind this one, but at the moment, it's all Olovic. He's backing Manidi up in the corner, with the viewers at home. Robert Manidi with the red trunks. A bit uh, light on top, whereas all of it, he's got the he's got the hair shaved, he's got it up, he's got a rat's tail, he's got everything. He's got two rat's tails, Johnny, <laughs> as he attempts a spinning back kick, absolutely unloading here on uh, Robert Maniti, not giving him a chance to settle at all. Robert not having any time to get rid of that ring rust, but he now starts to counter. Tell you what, all of it uh, has been all action so far. Johnny Cavity said Robert Manetti, 40 years of age. Full credit to him getting into the, to the ring at any age, but coming back at 40 years of age, great work. Yeah, Robert uh, was trained by the late master Dana Goodson. Now, how's that for uh, having the son, Aaron Goodson, in the corner with him? As you said, Johnny Cavity also allows to win, and Nick Thunderkick Telecurus. This one's action packed. Three two-minute rounds, and both boys just trading over there in the blue corner. Or oh, spinning back kick there from, from the psycho Olovic. Yeah, attempted uh, spinning back fist as well, but uh, Mediti now fighting back as well, urging Olovic to come on, give it to me. <laughs> and I tell you what, the Matthew Flinders Hotel, all of a sudden, Johnny Cap on the edge of their seats for this one. Bit of a welt appearing under the left eye of rapid fire, Robert Mediti. Big overhand right from all of it. Well, Rob's trademark was his hands rapid fire, so he'll be happy to get that first round uh, tucked away. And I'll tell you what, very happy with himself as well. Just smiling at the, the psycho Marco Olovic at the end of that first round. Great work from both fighters. Mark Cook is standing back, he's got the best seat in the house. The second round of three, proudly bought him by Chef Pierre. Hands again from Manini. Big hands from Olovic as well. Gee, at this rate, Johnny, I would expect a knockout in this bout. Both fighters absolutely letting go, loading up with everything that they've got. Yeah, big hands from Manini. Mark Cook, not sure whether he's putting a count on here or not, but 
it looked absolutely wobbled was all of it a bit of a warning there against Manini for holding the hand so Mark Cook is telling the, the officials to disregard it it looked like all of it was wobbled but it looks like Manini might have held the hand and come over the top of the big right hand of his own yeah all of it uh, recovers with the nice high roundhouse kick as well Great to see Theo Galetsis in the corner from Team Invictus. So I love calling Theo's fights as well. And he'll be holding the hand again. Yeah, look, there's a lot of big names here in both corners uh, for this bout, Johnny. Once again, a big thank you to uh, Michael and Con Vukovic for putting on this bout. You're watching Total Respect as Rapid Fire Maniti just lets go with those rapid fire combinations. That's a word to Mark Cook, I'm not happy about something, Johnny. <laughs> I tell you what, a big uh, shot of hearing under the left eye of Olivic as well. Big hands from Maniti. Look at Rob just letting go. Left and right combos. Bit of showboating now from the rapid fire. He's got his confidence back as he steamrolls Olivic <laughs> over there in the red corner. And some good evasive skills from Maniti. As you said, John, came showboating. A big high kick from Olivic just whizzed past. Maniti got out of the way. Oh, nice straight right hand from Rob. Looks to line it up. All of it attempts that spinning back kick. Good work by Veniti just to close the gap. Yeah, Robert just needs to keep his hands up as well. Uh, Welt appearing under the eye of both fighters here now in this bout, Johnny. Yeah, testament to the big bombing hands of both boys. Oh, there you have it. <laughs> End of round two, Mark did have to get in the middle and separate both these boys. This one proudly brought to you by Chef Pierre. A big shout out to Chef Pierre for getting behind this one. Johnny Kemp, two down, one to go. Action power. Third and final round so far. The bout of the evening, Johnny. Crowd absolutely on the edge of their seat as Robbie once again lets go with those rapid fire combinations. So what impressed with the, the resolve of both of these fighters, they are fast. Slapping kick there from all of it to the midsection. So what, Robert Manini at 40 years of age. Full credit to him, but I tell you what, he's probably gonna go home tonight and, and uh, get the Epsom salts out, John and Captain have a nice bath just to, to get the body back into shape again. Yeah, well I'm sure that he'll get a nice rub down from his partner Kim and a big shout out also to her. She'd be sitting here ringside, very proud of the display so far from Rob, as would all his family and friends that are here supporting him this evening. I note in the corner as well, his best mate and a good friend of mine, Johnny Apples. Big shout out to Johnny. He's been with Rob all the way on this journey for his comeback to centre ring. And Johnny Cave, you picked it earlier on, both boys, welts appearing under both eyes. Are they going to be able to see at the end of the fight literally the way they're going? Well, look at that. Absolutely letting go with the left and right bombs. Looks like a cut appearing under the right eye of Rob Benitti as all of it goes upstairs with that high round kick once again. Looping right hand from all of it just mixes the mark. They want Chef Pierre, you are getting your money's worth on this one, bounce seven of the night. It is total respect, and these boys are showing no respect to each other in centering. They're just standing there trading. Rob absolutely uh, muscling in once again now. He'll be looking to, to have his next fight under full tie rules, that's for sure, Johnny, I can tell you. He'd be frustrated not being able to use elbows. A bit of a catch and take down, which of course isn't allowed under the, the kickboxing rules. Johnny Kev, I'm going to go early. Fight of the night so far between these two boys. Yeah, we've really had the, the crowd on the edge of their seat. A lot of vocal support for both fighters. But it's been all action from the opening bell. Oh, there you oh, go. There you have it. One to go on with just afterwards as well from both boys. Have a look at that. You'd expect both fighters. They want to go another round at least. And why not? The crowd here at the Matthew Flinders Hotel on their feet. Very happy Nick Thunderkick Telekurus there. And the one Aaron Wilson Laos to you as well. And Johnny Apples up on the ring as well. Yeah, total respect shown from both these fighters here in centre ring. You have watched an absolute epic three round fight, and both fighters deserve your highest congratulations. Up.
after three rounds, we have gone to the judges' scorecards. We have a unanimous points decision. Your winner, Red Corner! Oh, convincing Red victory Corner. at the end of the day. And look at Robert Manitti as he gets down on his knees. Oh, he will be absolutely elated with that result. Yeah, unanimous points win there to rapid fire, Robert Manetti. What a comeback at 40 years of age.